everyone, it's Abby from Feather and Fossil Interior Design. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a closed cubicle design using Foyer Neo. First I'm going to go to the catalogue and search for a metal glass partition. There are two in the catalogue that will work for my design, so I'm going to start by using the solid frame to divide up my space. I'm going to use the resize tool to adjust it to the size I need. I'm then going to go to the textures panel and find a readered glass option. I'm going to apply this texture to the bottom panes and then use the rotate and texture size functions on the right hand side to adjust accordingly. I'm now going to use the other glass partition in the catalogue to create a closed cubicle. You'll notice this item has a door included in the partition. I'm going to use the rotate and resize tools to ensure it fits into the space. Next I'm going to start adding furniture to the room. I'm going to find a desk I like in the catalogue and then apply my own texture to create a bespoke piece. I'm now going to use the group product function at the top middle of the screen and then the clone tool to duplicate my furniture items and move them to the second office cubicle. I can then use the vertical flip tool to create a mirror image. I'm using the grid lines to ensure that both desks are equidistant from the wall. Next I want to change the textures on the wall. I'm going to search for a plaster finish which will not only change the colour but add texture to the look of my design. I now want to upload my own texture to add a bespoke floor to the design. I'm going to go to textures, upload and then follow the steps. Once my texture is uploaded I can apply it to the floor and then use the right hand side panel to rotate and change the size. I'm now going to remove the grid lines from my design. To do this, click on the grid lines on the top left and then use the trim tool in the middle and click on the lines you want to remove. To take the render, go to the top right hand corner and click on the take render. Line your screen up to the correct view and then use the lighting options on the left panel to adjust the internal and external lighting. Then click get preview in the bottom middle. Your preview will appear in the bottom right corner. If you're happy, then go back to the bottom middle of the screen and click take render. Select the 4K option for the best quality renders and then hit Get Render. And here are the finished designs. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to try Foyer's 14 day free trial. Click on the link in the description below. See you in the next video.